just four ingredients. Our next guest is creating a classic sweet treat the whole family is gonna love. I know this guy right here is gonna love it too. <laughs> here to make Simply Delicious peanut butter cookies is Diana Madison. Welcome, Diana. Thanks for being here. I am excited about this. So is Debbie, Ken, and Maria. They are lined up and ready to go, but they have to wait for us to make them first before they can okay. enjoy them. This is them. my favorite cookie. Is oh, it? Yeah. Like, yes, it's my favorite. Oh, that's so okay. Exciting. Okay. Yeah. Four ingredients. Quick. Keeping it simple, right? Sorry, Deb, what were you saying? I was going to say they're very quick, so we don't have to wait too long. You don't have no. to wait too That's long. True. That is the truth. But here's the point, everybody. You are an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. You're an actress. You are a social media influencer, mm -hmm. and you're a mom of two. How do you find time to get in the kitchen and to make these sweet treats like this? Well, there is no time, so you got to make time. you got to make time. That's yeah. it. The best thing about this is four simple ingredients, which you can find in your house, so yep. you don't have to go to the market. I like to incorporate my kids in activities that I have to do. So I have to cook, so I like to have the kids join me in the kitchen. And they have so much fun. Yeah. Um, this is something oh. that you Oh, they, love, they love it. They like getting Aww. their hands messy and yeah. That's a great idea in the sense that just kind of bringing your family into mm -hmm. things that are happening anyway. Right. That way you get extra time together. I'm gonna, yes. I'm How old are they now, Diana? So uh, my son is two and my daughter is four. Oh, I yes. Can't believe we it. need to do a play date. We have known yeah. each other for so many years right. since we were babies. Uh, we were babies. Two years ago? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's only been a couple of years. What yeah. are talking about? Not ten. <laughs> All right. Now, there's just four oh, yeah. ingredients, and one of them already in this bowl right yes. now. You've already beaten your eggs in the bowl right here. I will just be your one. professional mixer. Oh, thank you. How about God, that? Cameron. Good job. All right. Yes, thank you so much. What goes in next? Uh, we have uh, creamy peanut butter with no sugar added, and this okay. is one cup. The star yes. of the show, this the creamy it. peanut butter. Now, what about chunky peanut butter? I was what ask about that other question. types of peanut butter? I recommend using creamy peanut butter. That's the best one to use. Okay. But listen, get creative if you want to, but let's make it easy. We don't have much time. We've got the <laughs> kids, they're crying. It's gonna be Go as easy as it is, and creamy peanut butter. And is I the want way to, to say this too. I've tried it, as you guys probably can imagine, with almond butter, and it's just not the same. No, it's not. Like the same. not? It's not with well, the That's peanut the butter That's cookies. Not. You could do it. You could do it, but it's not the same. Yeah, I agree. Exactly right. Okay. Now we got two types of sugar here. Yes, we've got brown sugar. Okay. We've got granulated sugar, Excellent. and all you got to do is dump it in the bowl. Dump it in, and, so and I mix told it up. You I would be the mixer. If you're adding all that sugar, would it be essential to use no sugar peanut butter? Yes. Okay. Yes. Because uh, unless you have a babysitter or your in-law. I would recommend <laughs> <laughs> using peanut butter with sugar in it. Because the kids will be kids wired. Off. No, they will be wired. And, uh, you know, after a long day of work, you do not want to deal with that. So I recommend using peanut butter with no sugar in it. Boom. Oh, you're so good. This is, you want to come taking over? my job very, <laughs> very seriously yes. here, Diana. Okay, very good. So we've got our batter. Now comes to you got a little ice cream scoop. Yes, all right, so you're gonna uh, lay them out there. You got a little parchment paper. So if you don't, have, this is it. This is it. Four simple that's ingredients. It? Yes. And if you don't have this at home, I would just like this is what I do. I just use my hands. Right. I guess just, um, yeah. the oil here is all supposed to go in, or uh, that's for the that goes for the after. So after okay. we put it on the sheet, and okay. I would put like. Two, yeah. There you go. Okay. There we go. Uh, so obviously you should have done this because now I'm messy. That's okay. But you're gonna use your hands. Your hands. Yes. Camera so camera. I'm gonna get. This is how I do it in my house. Oh, and that's what that's for. So you do a cross hatch. Because it is not a peanut butter cookie without the cross hatch. Right. Isn't that? That it, is the truth. Very strongly about these cookies. Very strongly. <laughs> By the way, guess what? Once they cook, they're all gonna be fantastic I anyway. Know. So right. it doesn't really as matter. As anyway. long as it comes out looking good, okay. that's all that matters. Right. And tasting good, really. Doesn't even matter. You can go there and wash your hands. Okay. Let me wash my hands real quick. Diane. Yes. Yeah. You taught well, Cameron very yeah. well. It's the truth. He's so I good. Really fantastic. All right, you're coming well. okay. over, Cameron. You're going to be cooking with me, with the kids. What is the temperature we put these in the oven for, so, and for how long? So you do it for 350 degrees okay. for 10 to 12 minutes. There you and go. then um, after Ooh. 12 minutes, when you see it turning brown, you take it out of the oven, wait for it to cool off for five minutes. I just want to make things so simple for That's people great. out there, especially when you're a working right. parent. Like, you don't have time. These are ingredients you have in the house. Just Put it in a bowl, mix it, and it's ready to go. And look how amazing it comes out. You put some salt, put on, some top salt on top. You put All the right. salt on before you bake it or afterwards? Uh, you put it on before you bake okay. it. Yeah. Oh so God. you mix it yeah, up. You go ahead, sir. Well, right. You serve this up to us. Yes. Uh, besides being a Ooh. super mommy and an actress and a host right. and running your own empire, right. you also just added beauty entrepreneur. Right. To and thank your you for supporting. List. Thank you for supporting. I'm such a fan of this. You have the most amazing product called Glotopia. Yes. Tell everybody about it. Well, it all started out of a need. You know, I had my daughter four years ago, got a bad case of eczema. I needed to hydrate oh. my skin. I went to the drugstore because the dermatologist was like, hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. I didn't like what I saw at the pharmacy. So I was like, this needs to be done better. So I put my thinking cap on, created wow. Glotopia, which has prickly pear seed oil. And the whole thing is it hydrates your skin. So if you're a new mom, it's a great product to use because it hydrates, adds a glow, 
I mix it in my foundation moisturizer. Mm -hmm. I use it as is. As we speak, I'm like dipped in glow <laughs> chocolate. No, I'll, I'll take another. I might even put some in the, in the peanut butter cookie. It's, it's really that good. Nice. <laughs> but it's so. true that so many people struggle with eczema. My baby has eczema, yeah. and I've been mm -hmm. learning that so many yeah. people, this, so this is something that one especially thing, moms need. Right, one thing I learned is like skincare, there's a lot of products out there that aren't clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And clean beauty definitely needs a renaissance. A lot of the stuff are effective, but they're just like not, you're embarrassed to tell people you're using it. Wow. So I yeah. wanted to create a product that is effective, looks good, you're gonna be proud to use. And putting it in makeup, oh, it has the, a big difference. You know what happens? You get the J-Lo glow. People right. go, what's going on with you? Right, she, oh, she literally oh, is, she was like the inspiration behind oh, it. Oh, was she? Well, well, I always want to look like her. Like, <laughs> like Can her. I just say also, these melt in your mouth. Mm. These are melt in your mouth good. They really wow. are. They really mm. are. Wow, I see them. I need a third. <laughs> or, <laughs> or, <laughs> or fourth. For or the fifth. full recipe, you all can go to HallmarkChannel.com. And for Thank more you. from Diana, you can follow her on her social media at Diana Madison.